Hello all. All right, uh, this is a war update. And what I wanted to talk to you about was the absolutely unbelievable barbaric Oh, you've been making that noise. Okay, I've been wondering who's been, it's a bird up there. Anyway, um, so what the U.S. did was incredible uh, and a, an amazing war crimes. They bombed an oil refinery. No, not one, not two, no, not even three. They bombed 12 oil refineries in the, in the country of Syria. The pictures that are coming out are of course what you expect, huge fires. Uh, one picture they're showing on BBC is a gigantic oil spill all over the land. Unbelievable that they would do this right after the largest Earth's protest to get the UN to do something, to ever take place on the planet. And they do this horrific thing of spewing oil refineries all over the planet. They're up in flames. We have a few oil refineries here in the Bay Area. When something blows up with them or something, it's millions and billions of dollars to repair. Just one part of it. And they bombed 12 Syrian oil refineries. When we're so immersed in oil, I guess, that we can afford to do something like this. Take 12 oil refineries off land. Remember when we took just one off and, and a hurricane came in Louisiana here in the U.S. and gas prices went through the roof and there were shortages and all that? They bombed 12. Uh, okay, so anyway, um, in other news, the U.S. has put more sanctions on Russia to get them to go to war. My thoughts on this, I think the U.S., once they put their, their mind to going to war with, with that country, regardless of whether they did anything wrong or not, they're going to war with it. Uh, down below is someone on the Syrian side called Syrian Girl, and I want you to, to go to her website and get the side of the Syrians. You're not taking what the U.S. is saying. We need to find out what the real truth is. So that's a short update on the, uh, on the latest on War Worth. Till next time, and thanks for the ups and the downs and the uh, new subscriptions. I always think that that, that doesn't sound right, the new subscribers. And uh, until next time.